Vikings are known as legendary warriors that raided across the known world for centuries. Let us take you on a journey back in time and share the tradition with you. Raiding expeditions were arranged by chieftains and could be made up of entire fleets or just one or a few ships. Veteran raiders could also take the initiative and approach a local chieftain with a deal, offering part of the loot in return for the use of the chieftain's ship. Raiding was a violent trade that could result in fame and fortune, or in bitter death on foreign soil. Practicing and perfecting fighting was therefore a vital part of a raider's life. Where many first-time raiders had to settle for an axe or a spear from home, experienced warriors could afford armor that added to their chances of survival. On a long ship, every crew member was a fully equipped warrior. No dead weight was allowed. That was saved for the loot. Raiding expeditions could last from a few weeks up to a full year, all depending on the size of the force and what part of the known world the expedition went to. A legendary tradition to kill time during a long voyage was oar walk, which was both a sport and a way of taunting the enemy. Vikings believed that one's death was predestined by Norns. This made them take great risks, knowing that if they perished, it was meant to be. Dying bravely in battle was even better, since that could allow entry into Valhalla, the halls of Odin, chieftain of the gods. The Viking longship was a fearsome attacker. The shallow draft allowed for unexpected beach landings in waist-deep water, quickly unloading a full force of warriors. There is no more fearsome opponent than one who doesn't fear death and who aspires to die as bravely as possible. <laughs> 